I've just seen like kids as young as five. Uh, maybe you can see them in the distance working on these uh, recycling lands here. And uh, you know, something like this really opens your eyes, and you can see some more kids over there. And kids, this kid just come to me now. He's one of the workers who works here on these dump sites. So all these kids here as well. Guess who? Chico. Chico. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? What are you doing? Bardan. What are you doing? Are you plastic recycle? Yes. Okay, they're just telling me that they recycle, uh, they pick the plastic up here and they recycle it. And these guys work, they work barefoot as well. Yeah. So. This is actually the first proper uh, climb along the way. We've been climbing for about three miles now. I think it goes up for about another. If I could do it one leg, you guys can do it two, surely. It's through the roadside here. And these kids are selling it here. I don't know where it is, but, uh, but this is obviously the shell here. And uh, inside here is like a white flesh with seeds inside of it. It's really sweet. Really nice. First time I've, um, first time I've ever tried that. It's so nice. And it's sold by Raju here. Raju, say hello. <laughs> Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Okay, and that's his sister. I've been uh, indoor here. Indoor, yeah. Indoor, yeah. Oh. Uh, and uh, these guys are the indoor locals. And uh, behind here is a is a god called Rawan. Rawan Round the hen. Rawan the hen. Rawan the hen is from Sri Lanka. This god. Sri Lanka. Uh, from Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. And what they're gonna do is they're gonna burn him tomorrow. Yes. You're gonna yes. Agri guy. Ag ah. I'll agri guy. Ah. 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 So they're gonna burn him tomorrow. And uh, Cuba, Cuba's go agar gaye? Yeah, jab Sita Mata ko Sita Mata gayi thi na? Sita Haran ke liye. Sita Haran ke liye gayi thi. Haan. Ram Bhagwan isko maar ko aaye the. To isliye kisi ne usko maar diya. Us kisi ko maarte hai. Okay, so that basically translates as they're gonna screw him up and uh, something happened down the path, kind of stuff, and they're gonna burn him. Feel like guy Fox. Okay, thank you. Deal, please. Uh, you can see here, there's been a bit of a crash of traffic. Um, there's like a road that comes from here and road that goes there and traffic is just kind of like colliding with each other here. It's just zigzagging. There's no coordination whatsoever, it's just like trying to find your way around. Awesome. Some guy auditioning for X Factor. <laughs> Definitely know from me. What the hell was that? Get a blaster following me. <laughs> the best food to have in India, without doubt, street food. Now, I bought this. Uh, I put onion in the tail, lentil, the onion, onion there. It only cost 10 rupees, that's for 10 pence. And I bought it from this stand here. And they'll wash it with garlic coke. Goes down a well. Goes down a nice. Okay, well, um, uh, you certainly don't don't see this every day. This is. I don't have to say what that is. You know, Jack. No, 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 Just a biscuit. There you go. There you go. Look. You get greedy sometimes. Put my handlebar, there you go. There you go. I shoot, it's gone. What the hell is going on here? It's um It's probably a funeral. And, and nobody seems to crash or anything like that. People will just see in the dark here, it's amazing.
Yo, how's it going? Okay, well I'm at a uh, roadside cafe here. Uh, bikes there, and I'm gonna have uh, alu parata. Yes, you like? But uh, I'm gonna have some alu parata, and I have plenty of flies. Plenty of flies to keep me company. There's some guy there. Don't know if he's uh, sleeping or if he's just died. But uh, I'm looking forward to salad parata. Probably a favorite of mine. Definitely. Here it is. This is salad parata. Now, is it better than back home? Could it possibly be better than back home? Mmm. That's good. Certainly good enough to get the miles. I can't be my mother's. No chance. When you come to a small town or a village, it comes good luck. This is a real challenge of India to try and get past these small villages in traffic. You can't get away from the number of people here in the villages, that's for sure. Damn! There's cows, people, bloody everything, man. Is, this is the best convertible to impress the chicks. Yo kids, don't forget to put your seatbelt on. Man, this is true black road India here. Just see tourists in sight, all you see the villages, mud huts, a lot of farming going on. And it's uh, quite amazing actually to be out here. That's what I went in search for, man. I'm just assuming this taxi and these guys are having a conversation here. You can see. All looking fast. <laughs> All looking in, uh, in amazement and they're waving as well. So what the hell? As you can see, the roads get so bad and dusty here. I have to start taking uh, more cautious measures, I guess, with this mask. I look like a criminal, but uh, it protects me from some of the dust. Oh man, these are just these broken roads. It's beating me down, man. This is fucking hard, man. It really is beating me down. I've had this non-stop since India. It's died, man. And it's taking its toll now, I have to say. I'm only human. But, uh, uh, oh man. America wasn't a challenge. America wasn't a challenge, man. This is a challenge. Complain about your little pothole ever again back in the uh, UK. It is. <laughs> well, it's been a rough ride today. Most of the roads have actually been like this. Spent eight hours in the saddle, barely got 50 miles in. Uh, I've breathed in so much dust that I've, been, I've got like hay fever symptoms, like runny eyes and nose and sneezing and. Who needs a child safety seat, eh? Anyway, I got sideswiped earlier. I was holding my line straight. I was going in a straight line and a guy just smashed into the side of me. Oh well, it's normal over here. Many hours. That's absolutely disturbing, man. I no value for life, it's like... Um, I'm trying to get in 100 miles and I've got like about 25 left and I'm struggling. I'm not feeling good. I got a really sore throat, my body is just aching all over, my back, my butt. Uh, and uh, 
the fact that these lorries, they're like fog horns that go by here, they didn't help my cause either. I'm struggling to get to Kanpur, this is like about 25 miles away. Yeah. Very, very nice. India, India, agriculture. India, agriculture. Yeah, very cultural. Yes. You have graduation from English. Yes. Oh, okay. Language and literature both are. And you are graduate from this, yes. right? Yeah, your English is very, very good. Yes. Very good. Amazing. Our degree half ten. 78 Wow Okay But there's a bypass, yes? So you are go Okay Bypass uh -huh. Fatipur Bypass Fatipur, ah, okay Similarly uh -huh. Just drive, no inter Okay But uh -huh. bypass Okay That's nice to be a friendly aggression uh, So bypass here, yes? Yeah, bypass Okay, thank you, thank you so much Very, very helpful What's your name? Ram Sharan. Ram Sharan, very nice, thank you. Such labor intensive hauling these logs on their bicycles. No sign of a iPad, iPod, Game Boy. I mean, the only app they have is the, uh, is the application of pure, pure hard work. And uh, it really, it really humbles you to see that, man. I mean, the force to grow up pretty fast here. Okay, I'm about to get some uh, sugarcane juice. I don't know if it's sugar cane, but it's delicious. Uh, they call it, they call it gana here. Gana. This is what it is. This stuff here. And by some, Nadik. And uh, all this for ten rupees, which is ten pence. And uh, this is the result right here. <sighs> that was nice. I think you got something in your back wheel. Yeah. That's nice. From the dry, hot, arid and mountainous landscape of Iran and Oman, to the luscious green mountains of East India as I, uh, as I make my way towards Kolkata my, uh, more or less my ride to India kind of ends here at Kolkata these two dogs <clears throat> yeah, it's been manic <clears throat> but uh, the one thing that I tell you what for better or worse I'll never forget my time here Quite experience. And uh, also signifies the end of my ride in India. Uh, either I go to Bangladesh from here or China, depending on visa. Bangladesh.